little boys. <laughs> hi, Mickey. Hi, Mickey. I'm a girl. Well, hi, you, Donald. Daisy. Hi, Goofy. Come on in. Uh, say, uh, uh, Minnie, <laughs> the gang's all here. And just in time for popcorn. <laughs> row, 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 row. <laughs> well, we couldn't have movie night without popcorn, could we? Or movies. <laughs> say, uh, who's got one? Well, I've got one. Backyard vacation. Backyard vacation? Uh-huh. We stayed right here in the Magic Kingdom for that one. Remember? Oh, I remember. Ro, ro. <laughs> well, what are we waiting for? Come on, let's watch it. Watch the popcorn. Approaching the entrance to the Magic Kingdom. Please watch your step as you leave the monorail. Thanks for riding, folks, and have a great day. Good morning, ladies and gentlemen, boys and girls. All of us here at the Magic Kingdom are glad to have you as our guests on this special day. for quite a spell, so I can steer you to some real hometown fun and some dime store bargains. Once upon a time, there lived a beautiful girl named Cinderella. She had an evil stepmother and two evil stepsisters who were jealous of her beauty. Before the princess ball, all the animals and her fairy godmother helped Cinderella make a beautiful gown. At midnight, Cinderella had to run away because the magic was about to wear off. The prince found her by using the glass slipper and they lived happily ever after.
astronaut should proceed to loading areas A and B. Passengers are now boarding for direct flight to Riker 1. Report to your spacecraft for final liftoff instructions. Delegates in Philadelphia have signed the Constitution and the colonies have joined together. All Liberty Trees are to be lit tonight in celebration. This government must be preserved in spite of the acts of any man or set of men. Nowhere in the world is presented a government of so much liberty and equality. To the humblest and poorest among us, I held the highest privileges and positions. Our reliance is in the love of liberty which God has planted in us. now, especially them hats and glasses, cause this here's the wildest ride in the wilderness! Just up ahead there, my cousin Zeke's got a new cabin. Looks like Zeke's having a housewarming party. Anyway, that's Tom Sawyer's Island off to the right there. 
And them's the rafts you have to ride to get over there. Pretty funny looking little rigs, ain't they? Cargo, dearie. Show them your larboard side. Aye, the redhead! We want the redhead! We want the redhead! <laughs> Quiet, the scums! Say, have you set your eyes on a bewitched maiden in your travels? Okay, folks, slide all the way forward now. That's how I keep the seat cushions clean on this boat. Well, welcome aboard, crew. I'll be your skipper, alligator wrestler, and swimming instructor on a cruise that can only happen here in the Magic Kingdom. Hey, look what we found. A secret bathing pool of the Indian elephants. It's okay to stare, folks. They're all wearing their trunks. Look out in the back. This one looks a little angry. Parents, this is a good time to hold up your kids to see the action. They make great shields. Now, over there is a giant python. They're real friendly creatures. They can even get a crush on you. <laughs> you know what I mean. Something tells me we're not out of the woods yet, because when you've been in the jungle as long as I have, you begin to smell. Smell danger, that is. Danger lurks around every bend in the jungle, so keep your favorite family members inside the boat. Composed of myself, my good wife, and my three sons, we were the sole survivors of the ill-fated ship Titus. From the wreckage, we built this abode, fashioned among these branches with patience, ingenuity, and the steadfast perseverance of all hands. Surely, this is the safest and most charming home in the world. Imagination and happiness would come together for all. 
We hope Walt Disney World has brought joy and inspiration and new knowledge to all who have come to this happy place, where the young at heart of all ages can laugh, play, and learn together. Fun day that was. Boy, you can say that again. What a fun day that was. <laughs> George, who's got the next video? Row, 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 row. How did I know the best? Well, Donald and I brought this one. It's from our day at Epcot. Epcot? Oh, I can hardly wait. Okay, here we go. Welcome to Epcot, the realization of Walt Disney's dream of an experimental prototype community of tomorrow. Upon entering the main gate at Epcot, you can't miss Spaceship Earth. This one million pound 18 story geosphere is the largest in the world and is dedicated to the history of communications. In primal tribes, our ancestors create a lasting reminder with cave paintings. Hieroglyphics mark the rise of the written language. With papyrus scrolls, the written word begins to travel across the land. With the invention of the printing press, the Renaissance brings renewed interest in poetry, music, science, and art. On this wave of inspiration, we sail into a bold new era of communications. Today, we've created a vast electronic network, stretching from our homes to the reaches of space. Just outside Space Shipper, you'll find seven more high-technology pavilions all around you. The first is the Living Seas. Try to imagine a world where we've spent less time than on the surface of the moon. A world that holds enormous potential for mankind. A world we've just begun to explore. Welcome to Sea Base Alpha. Hydrolator 1 descending to Sea Base Alpha. Roger number 1. Notify when clear of docking port. As you enter the visitor center, your sink cab is passing through part of our beautiful Coral Reef community. Commander Fulton, you have a call on line one. About 10 4. Now, we have quite a variety of sea life living within our base of operation, which is the largest of its kind in the world. Don't be too surprised at what else you might find. At the Land Pavilion, you'll learn all about man's relationship to the Earth and the technology to produce food. Or try a wide assortment of your favorite dishes in the farmer's market. Research continues to give us better plant and animal production, as well as new insight into growing new plants in new environments. Fish farming is one of our fastest growing food industries. In a small aqua cell, we can produce tons of seafood crops. Some of these plants have great potential for the future, and many of our crops are served in Epcot restaurants. Inside the glass pyramids, a journey into imagination awaits some of the most exciting experiences in all of Epcot, including a hands-on electronic funhouse and a dazzling 3D movie. Oh, hello there. I am the dream finder. I search the universe for sounds, color, ideas, anything that sparks the imagination. You never know what kind of figment you may come up with. Here's my favorite, a figment of imagination. Look, a rainbow. I'll use that for painting. Come on, everybody, let's go. You can paint anything your heart desires with a computer or play with all sorts of wonderful things. Or come to my own special stage, where you can act out your own dreams. <laughs> oh, there you go. You guys can pet him. It's all right. Everybody having a good 
Opening soon at Epcot, Test Track, a behind-the-scenes look at the never-before-seen world of automobile design and testing. Test Track allows Disney guests to see firsthand the safety and engineering of today's automobiles. The illusion of high speed is produced by the suspension system. How far you are from the ground, straightaways, banking curves, and other factors characteristic of high speed travel. Now you'll feel the thrill of pushing a car to its limits. America's legendary entertainment company has teamed up with the world's largest car maker to create the longest, fastest, and most physical ride in Disney history. Fasten your seatbelts, because you're going to the limit on Test Track. The Horizons Pavilion draws on the wisdom and countless scientists and visionaries to present a view of the future with an ending that you get to choose. Easy living has always been just around the corner. Well, some ideas were a little hair-raising right from the start. But let's take a look at the future now. Now here's your chance to take an exciting ride through the future of your choice. Inside the wonders of life, satisfy your curiosity about the fantastic machinery of life in a place of learning and fun. Be sure to catch The Making of Me, Disney's own movie on the creation of life. Try the perplexion vibes where your sense of touch can fool you. Audio antics play tricks on your ears. Or try your hand at reading Braille. Some things are just touchy subjects. How good are you at feeling your way around? For a real thrill, take a ride in Body Wars. Because of a highly sophisticated and ingenious process, not only will your ship be miniaturized, it will be beamed below the skin of a volunteer so that you will be able to view the inner workings of the human body. Stand by! We're being attacked by the white blood cells! In the Energy Pavilion, you'll learn about the world's natural fuels. Dynamic forces, sending a constant flow of energy through time. Let us now look at the origins of man's energy sources, starting with the beginning of fossil fuels. The remnants of these early creatures have become the primary source of energy used in the world today. Petroleum oil is the natural substance remaining from these once mighty creatures. Welcome to Epcot, everyone. We're approaching the International Gateway, which will take you right into the heart of the World Showcase. And enjoy your day in Epcot. The Canada Showcase is a short walk from the International Gateway and the first country we'll visit on our journey. Canada offers rose gardens, totem poles, and a Circle Vision 360 movie. Journey with us now through the color and the contrast of our magnificent land. Where the past and the future are an inseparable part of the present. Only a stone's throw from any city in Canada. There's the great outdoors. You can be a part of nature out there and see life in the wild all around you. The United Kingdom is right next door to Canada and offers unique shopping across eight different architectural styles. While browsing for teas, candy, toys, or fine British clothing, you'll wander through an elegant London square and a rural countryside.
Inside the Rose and Crown, the beer and ale are the toast of any first class local in London. Here's a pint of Paseo. Cheers, mate. Just over the International Gateway Bridge from the United Kingdom, you'll find the beautiful showcase yeah, of France. Yeah, very nice. Your eyes are pretty cute. So tell me, how long do you stand up, guy? Do you like it, man? Along with the sights of the Parisian street artists and French locals, your senses will be overwhelmed with the sound of musicians on the street corner, the smell of perfume from the shops, or sit back with a glass of wine and just watch the world go by. Come with me on a voyage through my impressions de France. From the cold green north, they come to see the elegance of Chambord. The still day, nothing makes us prouder than to celebrate the birth of our republic. Paris, the living symbol of every age, across the face of my beloved France. Just around the corner from France, you'll find authentic music and fun in the Morocco Showcase. Inside the marketplace, hand-woven baskets, sheepskin wallets, and fine brass pots and serving sets can be found. <laughs> Delicious local dishes and traditional entertainment from this North African country can be found in the restaurant Marrakesh. The next showcase on our journey is Japan, which is possibly the most serene in all of World Showcase. At the teppanyaki dining room, a taste of traditional delicacies is a show in itself. Be sure to pay attention to the local customs. Along the water's edge, you'll find the Renaissance architecture of the Italy Showcase. The gondolas at the water's edge, the tiles in the buildings, and the statues in the courtyard are all exact replicas from the old country. Inside Alfredo La Original de Roma, sit down and enjoy a serving of fettuccine Alfredo tossed in butter sauce and imported Italian cheese. The Germany showcase was inspired by the Rhine and Bavarian regions, and it's just around the bend from Italy. I hope you like them. The Oktoberfest celebration in the beer garden is just as lively as any you'll find in Munich. In contrast to the merriment in Germany, the nearby China showcase is dominated by Disney's replica of the Temple of Heaven. Outside the gardens, you may see a traditional Chinese dance, wishing passers-by good fortune. Or maybe another pair of mischievous characters. Inside the pavilion, you'll get a rare look at ancient Chinese handcrafts and art. Really, this one in China we call it Xiu Pian. The material is uh, silk, the line is gold, here's the dragon. China also features the splendor of a Circle Vision 360 film. In my time, I travel all over China. In the faces of all the people, and in the vastness of the land, you can see the history of my country. From the Volvina city, there are many distant lands within her borders. 
You've seen many faces of China, but her beauty is as endless as time. Nestled between China and Mexico, the Norway Showcase celebrates the Viking heritage, folklore, and history of one of the world's oldest cultures. What's this? How dare you come here? This is a Trojan country. Get away, invaders! who seek the spirit of Norway, seek peril and adventure. Look first to the spirit of the seafarer. To know the spirit, discover the land's heart and soul. Our spirit lives in daring. It lives in our traditions. Hola, welcome to the Mexico Showcase. Near the San Angelina, the mariachi band will stir anyone from their siesta. You may even be inspired to try some of the local dances. Inside the third century, Mesoamerican Pyramid is a tribute to Mexican culture and a relaxing boat tour of Mexican life and history from Mayan high priests to modern day Mexican dancers. fathers never dreamed of an America like this. <laughs> of course not. We weren't dreamers. We were visionaries. That is why our Constitution withstands the rigors of time. Ladies and gentlemen, boys and girls, Epcot proud to present a shimmering symphony of lasers, lights, and fireworks in the dramatic spectacular of Illuminations. Disney designed Epcot in the belief that people could solve problems if equipped with information, technology, and opportunity. From all of us here at Walt Disney World, we hope you enjoyed your day at Epcot. Oh, Daisy, that was wonderful! Yeah, I feel like I've been around the world in 20 minutes! Gorge, <laughs> hope we don't get jet lag. There, Pluto. Huh. I guess we're next, huh, Minnie? I guess so. <laughs> well, we wanted to add a little glitz and glamour to the evening, so we brought a tape of one of our days at the studio. Oh, this ought to be good. Hit the light, would you? Ladies and gentlemen, today I'm standing outside the greatest top of show business in Hollywood at the Disney Studios. Wait a second, I see the limousine door just about to open. Yes, it is. It's Mickey Mouse. Oh, gee, I am Mickey Mouse. And with Mickey, you'll usually.
actually find? Yes, it is. It's Minnie Mouse. She's dressed in a magnificent red dress that makes her look as stunning as ever. Her fans are going crazy. It looks like the Disney characters have shown up today for a spectacular day at the Disney Studio. Toledo. How you doing, folks? Slick Mick McDaniels, talent agent to the stars. Welcome to the crossroads of the world on the beginning of your Hollywood tour. Well, here in Hollywood, it's not what you know, it's who you know. So remember, folks, Sid Kawenga is the man who knows all. So what do you say? We start this journey off right and head right on over to Sid's. Well, 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 good morning, and ning 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 I will tell you this morning, I'm Sid Coenga. This is Sid Coenga, one of a kind, truly collectible. Yes, indeed. I, I assume that you're movie buff, you know? Yeah, that old Sid knows everyone in this town. Over the years, he's grabbed all kinds of Hollywood memorabilia that you can get your hands on in the store. And in Hollywood, everybody has a headshot. Go and get your picture taken at the cover story. Okay, guys, you got your headshot done and you look absolutely perfect. But here in Hollywood, you gotta walk the walk, talk the talk, and dress the part. So where else better to shop than on the corner of Hollywood and Vine? Over here at the Keystone Clothiers, we'll get you gussied up for fashion. And then later on, we're gonna take you down to the Gromit Chinese Theater, where I got a director that's gonna put you in his next motion picture. <laughs> Okay, get ready. The director I know is shooting his next movie right here at the Great Movie Ride. Cut! Hold it right there. What do you think you're doing, dear? You've walked into the middle of my shot. You've just ruined the entire thing. Your disregard for the greats is appalling. Look at you, standing on someone so famous as this. The entire film world, the Chinese theater, all built on names like this, and there you are, standing on it with a glaze on your eyes. Come over here where I can see you. Blonde hair, blue eyes. You're charming, you're stunning, you're compelling. Have you ever acted before? Smile, frown, laugh, <laughs> cry. Oh, you take direction well. Go see a movie, think about it. I'll see you tomorrow, soundstage four. Oh, it's not easy being a genius. It's the Great Movie Ride! Oh, hello, everybody. My name is Susan, and I'm proud to welcome you to the Great Movie Ride. Let me take you from this Hollywood soundstage right to the middle of the action of the greatest films ever made. Is everybody ready? Yeah! Now I move towards the unknown dangers that lurk in the shadows of the big city. This is the underworld. <gasps> like, what are you doing? The heat's up. You gotta get out of here. You don't want to get these kind of people hurt, huh? Who are you? What, what's going on? Just a businessman in a tight squad, and you're in the middle, huh? Did you get out of here? Here they come, boss! Can there check grinders? Hey, quiet out there! <laughs> didn't get cast. Hey, not to worry. Step up a lip. There's more to be done here in Hollywood than just acting. For example, 
over here at the Superstar Television. We can learn what it's like to work behind the scenes. And at the Monster Sound Show, let's learn how sound travels. And last but not least, let's see the stuntmen do what they do best. Over at the Indiana Jones Stunt Spectacular. And don't forget, if you make any money, I discovered you first. Howdy, partner. You here to see Indy? <laughs> possible. Right across the way from the stunt show, you'll find the Muppet 3D movie and Star Tours. I do wish I could go to Endor with you, R2. above the hustle and bustle of all that movie magic and fantasy. Sometimes it's just fun to be a kid again. And what better place to do that than here at the Honey I Shrunk the Kids Playground. excitement like that, you must be starved. I myself prefer 
a hot dog here on New York Street, which happens to be Disney Studios' largest set. But you, you gotta get noticed. What are you doing here? We gotta head you over to the Sci-Fi Diner and the Primetime Cafe so you can be seen eating lunch with the big wigs. Bon appetit. Calling all girls, you're invited to ride the first spaceship to Mars. Be the first in your block to experience the thrills and chills of riding in space. Fabulous new wonders await you in the future. The Sci-Fi Diner has to be one of the hippest places in Hollywood. Step back in time to the days of the drive-in movie, enjoy the show, and have one of the best all-American burgers on the planet Earth. At the Primetime Cafe, you'll feel right at home with a good home-cooked meal and a few words on table manners. Yeah, elbows off the table. You're slouching, big guy. Come on, that napkin goes on your lap. Good job. We'll be back to check on you. Meet up. Welcome, everyone, to the Backstage Studio Tour. You're on a shuttle ride that will take you behind the scenes of a working motion picture and television studio. It's gonna be a real adventure. We're now entering the studio's lighting, audio, and camera departments. Here we put together equipment packages for film and video production shooting on our back lot and stages. We are now entering our back lot. This is known as Residential Street. You may notice something odd about each of these houses. Every single one is just a facade or false front. When production companies work on the back lot, the script sometimes calls for total control over the entire area. You may be able to see some of the specialized equipment it takes to make these productions a reality. Even the dog houses here are special. Just ahead is the Bulldog Cafe. You may recognize it from one of your favorite Disney movies. This is our New York street back lot. We use a few movie tricks such as forced perspective to give the illusion of an entire city. Like most studio boneyards, ours is filled with bits and pieces of movie memorabilia. See if you can identify any of the famous movies and actors that might have used these vehicles. They were using all kinds of movies! <laughs> we're now entering a large standing set used for special effects. As you can see, they're not filming right now. Okay, roll them! <laughs> oh my gosh, I thought they weren't filming today. Hang on, everybody, it looks like we're going to be in the sea. Follow me. Come on, let's go backstage and see how they really make movies. On the walking tour, you get a first-hand look at actors, directors, producers, and all the other crew members it takes to make a feature film or television show. You may even see a full-scale mock-up of a real passenger jet. It even comes apart so they can light it and shoot easier. All right, here we are, the animation tour. This is where animation begins. With a good story, adventure, romance, humor, and suspense. In this department, many story elements are born as sketches pinned up on a storyboard. When an animator is armed with a pencil and an active imagination, almost anything can happen. Here you can see an animator using a mirror in order to get that facial expression just right for his character. This is the layout and background department. The layout artist draws the sets, and the background artist paints them. The background artist also establishes the mood of the scene by painting with the right colors. In this example, you can see how the various background elements, such as shadows and footprints, are combined together to form a scene. Be sure not to check in late at the Hollywood Tower Hotel. Hollywood Tower Hotel? Donald? <laughs> this is gonna be good! Donald, I have a very bad feeling about this place. This is not this Isn't it supposed to be the haunted? Oh, I can't look. Oh. Okay, Bob. Oh. <laughs> Come on, Daisy, don't be tricky. Oh, that's strange. 
Chuck Dan gives me fun. Nighttime here in Hollywood has got to be one of my favorite times. The limelight here never fades, even at sunset. At night, we have our own stars that light up the sky. Gorge, they sure make you feel like a star there, don't they? Well, huh, I guess that's it then, huh? Time to call it a night. Pluto, Pluto, what is it, boy? Whoa. Well, you've got a tape to play, too. What's that? I, I don't know, but let's find out. Soon to be discovered by you and all the people of the world. The latest addition to the Walt Disney World Resort, Disney's Animal Kingdom. On over 500 acres, Disney Imagineers and renowned animal experts have literally gone wild combining the magic and fun of a Disney theme park with the drama and majesty of the animal world to build the most innovative and imaginative experience we've ever created. will travel into the distant past to come face to face with creatures that roam the earth millions of years ago. You will witness the challenges faced today by the animals with whom we share this planet. And in between, you'll see the colors, hear the sounds, and feel the presence of over 200 species of mammals, birds, reptiles, and amphibians. Disney's Animal Kingdom will sweep you away to far-off locations that many of us might never see. Once inside the park, leave the urban world behind and enter the oasis. A plush paradise full of exotic birds and animals, tumbling waterfalls that fill the air with cool mist, and the first of over 4,000 varieties of plants and trees you'll find here. And nearby, the one tree at Disney's Animal Kingdom found nowhere else in the world, towering 145 feet above the surrounding landscape, the Tree of Life a symbol of the richness, the majesty of the animal kingdom. The surface of the tree is elaborately covered with the swirling image of all animal life on Earth. Surrounding the tree of life is Safari Village, where colorful and playful images of animals appear everywhere you look. A journey that starts at Safari Village starts with a real sense of fun. Just a bone's throw away is Dinoland USA. There stands the Golden Gate Bridge archway, formed by the 40-foot tall skeleton of a colossal dinosaur. Dinoland USA is a place where the fascination of these creatures we all had when we were kids comes out in the playful atmosphere. Next, venture into the treacherous dinosaur ride, Countdown to Extinction. In this dramatic thrill ride, your time travel vehicle will journey back 65 million years and put you in the middle of a time when dinosaurs were ferociously alive and the Earth was theirs to rule. In another direction from Safari Village is Africa. You enter Africa through the colorful marketplace town of Harambe. Your departure point, the exciting Kilimanjaro Safaris. Here you'll explore 100 acres of savanna, forest, rivers, and rocky hills where hundreds of African animals roam free. Your rugged safari vehicle will take you and your fellow adventurers over rough, rugged tracks through amazingly realistic East African landscapes. Out here in this protected wildlife reserve, poaching is a constant threat and your expedition takes a dramatic turn when you stumble across a band of poachers and take off after them. 
How will this dramatic adventure end? From there, your next stop is Conservation Station, the command post for Nala at Disney's Animal Kingdom. Here, a wide variety of exciting interactive experiences will connect you to animal care experts and to global conservation activities. You'll see how Disney's Animal Kingdom cares for its own, as well as wildlife all around the world. In addition, the affection section will give a whole new meaning to hands-on experiences with some of the most lovable little characters you've ever seen. And speaking of lovable characters, some of your favorite stars of Disney animation will also be there at Disney's Animal Kingdom in an enchanted land of their very own. You'll have many chances to meet them and see them in spectacular live stage shows like the Festival of the Lion King and the Jungle Book. After all that excitement, of course you'll want to take in sensational entertainment, intriguing shopping opportunities, and tempting dining experiences, all in keeping with the magical character of Disney. Disney's Animal Kingdom will engage and inspire millions of people, creating new respect and appreciation for the wild places of this earth. From the heart pounding to the heart warming, this is just a sample of the thrills, the emotion, and the sweeping spectacle of adventure awaiting you at Disney's Animal Kingdom. Oh, gosh, Pluto, that was just swell. You know, watching all these videos sort of puts me in the mood for another vacation. Me too. Me three. <laughs> but where should we go? Maybe, uh, we should stay right here. <laughs> what do you think? Oh, 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 oh. Oh, oh, don't forget a video camera. <laughs> a video camera. Oh, gosh, no, we won't forget old pal. <laughs> oh, gosh. <laughs> 